Hi, I'm Lucia. Today I'm going to tell you about the past continuous. I will first give you some examples. Yesterday morning I was enjoying the weather. At 10 o'clock my friend was doing his homework. We were sitting in the garden when my uncle arrived. These sentences are all in the past continuous. How do we make the past continuous? You start with the subject. In the examples they are I, my friend and we. Then you add a past tense of the auxiliary verb to be. In the sentences the forms of to be are was was, were. If you have watched the video about the verb to be, you know there are only two forms of the past tense of to be, was and were. I will repeat them for you. I was, you were, he, she, it, was, we were, you were, they were. After the subject and the auxiliary verb to be, you have to add the main verb ending with ing. So, for example, enjoying, doing, sitting. We have now got the main part of the sentences with the past continuous. I was enjoying. My friend was doing. We were sitting. You can now add the rest of the sentence. If you want to make a negative sentence in the past continuous, you have to add not between the form of to be and the main verb. So, for example, we were not sitting in the garden when my uncle arrived. To make a question in the past continuous, you put the form of to be in front of the sentence and then the subject and the main verb. After that, you can add the rest of the sentence. For my example sentence, it would be like this. Was I enjoying the weather yesterday morning? What exactly is the past continuous? It is used to talk about something that was happening at a certain time in the past. At that moment, the action had already started, but was not yet finished. So, when I say, at 10 o'clock, my friend was doing his homework, it means that he started his homework before 10 o'clock and finished it sometime later. When you looked at him at 10 o'clock, he was busy doing it. You can also use the past continuous to describe what was happening when the main action in the sentence happened. Let me give you an example. I was eating when my boss called. This means that I was eating and then my boss called so I had to stop eating. I will give you another example of how you can use the past continuous. We were talking while the teacher was explaining the subject. If you look at the sentence, you can see there are two past continuous verbs. When you use two or more forms of the past continuous in a sentence, it means that several things were happening 
at the same time. The teacher was explaining, but we were not listening because we were talking to each other. The last thing I'm going to talk about is annoying habits. We use the past continuous and the word always to talk about annoying things which happened in the past. These annoying habits are now finished. For example, my teacher was always shouting at us. The teacher possibly still shouts at his pupils, but you no longer have that teacher. Our neighbour was always making a lot of noise. The neighbour might still make a lot of noise, but he might have moved house, or you might have moved house, or he might have stopped making the noise. That is it for today. To give you a short overview of what we have learnt today, the past continuous is used to say that something was happening at a certain time in the past. It can also be used to describe several things that were happening at the same time. And finally, you can use it to talk about annoying habits in the past. See you again next time.